Hello everybody, this is the sneak peek for next e-seminar on using project templates and master slides in Adobe Captivate 5. So what exactly are we going to look at in that e-training? Let's say I am creating a template to be used by multiple people for creating an effective content and I would like to maintain branding and other related assets so that uh, everybody's content looks consistent. Okay, but for this, what I'm going to do is insert a placeholder object that's an image, and I'm going to resize this image placeholder to a dimension, and I'm going to insert a text caption placeholder. And for this text caption placeholder, I'm going to apply an object style which I've already defined. Okay, our template file is ready. I'm going to save this. Now let's create a new file, new project based out of this template that is file new project and project from template and I'm going to choose this file what is saved now that's template1.cptl as my base template. Now my new project opens with this placeholder when I double click on the image placeholder it asks for a image to be chosen so I'm going to import a new file that's a device.jpg and that's nice the image comes up now when I double click on text caption placeholder now the text caption placeholder becomes an actual caption I have some text already typed in what I'm going to do is to copy this and paste it inside the caption and delete unwanted characters and here is my file ready we are going to learn all of this and more in the upcoming e-training on using project templates and master slides in Adobe Captivate 5 so if you have not registered yet please go ahead and register now and till then have a great